da 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 Tequila! Tequila! <laughs> bye bye! <laughs> <laughs>
This will put hair in your chest. This, because of the little potion bottle, actually looks like it's for putting hair in your chest. Yeah. Why do they all have a bee on them? I think it's the logo. I think oh. because agave is like a, is it a derivative of honey? This is the tequila that comes to the club in its own limo. This tequila has stilettos. A little sniffy. Mm, so far, it tastes like the other ones. Smells like them. Cheers! Cheers! We numb it down. Similar, again, like, like a tiny bit of... It now feels more like when you have it in the club, when yeah, you're like... Mm, we're at that level now. Taking another one. Yeah. This one is ferocious. Very, very smooth. Yeah, very watery or something with my first thing. I thought, oh, it's a little lemony or something. It's very bitter. That one is stingier than the last. The first one I thought was the smoothest. Mm. And then this one's quite like... I don't know why people think that I don't get drunk. Well, you're just a trooper though. You're like, I, I've never seen anything affect you. But it, you, like I do, you <laughs> feel it. You feel it. You yeah. know? You can feel that. I'm getting a really taste of um, a nejo. Yeah, someone, a nejo. You know, very a nejo y. Literally, you put this up to your lips and the tequila, it just gets inside your mouth. You don't even have to tip it high enough for gravity to do the job. This tequila wants to be drunk. It's lovely. It Honestly, they all taste the same. But this one, no, this one's slightly more flavoursome, but they all taste the same. I'd have a bottle 10 times this size and just sip it all day. This has a little bit of something more to it, but as we were saying, like this feels easier to drink now because I'm like <laughs> having a good time now. Now you see, I don't think this is a party one. I think this is more of a sitting in a upholstered chair, mm. listening to vinyls. It's sippable. People are going, what, what do you have? <laughs> Martin, I think you have a problem. It's sippable. Oh, look at this. Oh, God. Ooh. Is this coffee? Now yeah, we're talking. Coffee liqueur. Oh, my God. Mm. So pretty. And I love the packaging. Ah. I love that they went with lilac on top of the brown. It's gorgeous. That's stunning. XO Cafe. Coffee liqueur. Made with Patron Silver. That's my fave. Coffee fan? No. Oh, you're not? Not a coffee fan. Oh, this is good. I'm going to drink all this. I'm not supposed to have it. <laughs> But I do enjoy a single cup in the morning before my spin class to give me an extra zhuzh when I'm going out the door. 25, it's a little bit weaker than the others. It's so it's sick. Oh, it's Syrupy. Like, it's like treacle. It is like treacle. Do you like coffee and alcoholics? Yeah, I do. Yeah. I do. It's two, like, aggressors together. What could go wrong? What could possibly what could go, go wrong? wrong? It's like Romeo and Juliet. It's like two star-crossed. Yeah, each with a flamethrower, you know? All right, I'll try a little sipple actually first. That's amazing. That's very good. That's gorgeous. It's lower in percentage, but it tastes stronger. Yeah. But I feel like I'm ready to do an exam or to go for a run. Is good. That is nice sip, Actually, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. All right. I, I almost don't want to down it. I know, it's, it's very nice. They are, they are, I mean, it says, you were saying it says it's, it's perfect for sipping and num num num. Yeah. <laughs> Straight from the bottom. Maybe don't inhale it. What would you have that with now? Would you just drink it as a shot or would you? It's kind of like a baby Guinness without the creamy stuff in it. My coffee fan, I don't mind the sugary coffee. Yeah. Oh yeah? I started with the sugary coffee and that's how they get you. That is by far the best. This is isn't it? stunning. I would drink that straight. That could be used for- We did drink for, it straight. We did, but I would drink many more I of I would do it shots. again. Maybe an espresso martini. Or how about that in a hot chocolate? The fun is, you should try and make it at home with coffee and tequila, it's a big pot, big, a cauldron. Oh yeah. And fill these kinds of bottles with it. Oh, I've been there, it didn't work. Oh, no. <laughs> I seem to find that coffee works well with any alcohol. Any alcohol I've had on this channel or like in general. Not with wine. Oh. Mocha. Have that with a mocha. Espresso martini. Yes. I spilled coffee in my cereal once though and I was like, why didn't I think of this before? This is oh, brilliant. Yeah. Do they do bigger bottles? Uh, they have to. They can't just sell it in that, could they? They couldn't. If they do a bigger bottle, I want this for Christmas. It is divine. I love tequila. I love it so much. I wish I like. I wish, I want to make it my drink. I can see why it's popular. What's that rapper's name? Is that the song about it? Little John. Little John. I'll uh, look into him now. I was a little bit apprehensive because tequila is not usually something I would really enjoy. Like whenever I taste it, I'm too drunk to really understand its complexities. But this was a little bit of a journey. Personally, I'm a whiskey man myself, but after whiskey, I'd have to say tequila is a very close and beloved second place. The main thing is we weren't huge tequila fans coming in and we're, we've been, we're now, we're now, we've popped our tequila cherry. Mm. Cherry would be a nice flavor actually. Mm, on the subject. Yeah. Uh, if you'd like a shot <laughs> at liking and subscribing to the channel, then you should do that because we'll bring you more videos 
Like this. I mean, honestly, what more, more do you want? This is it. Do it. Go on. Be sound. You're good, crack. Go on. Tell your mother I was asking for. Her. <laughs>